In this story, we will learn the numbers 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 and 100. Hmm, isn't the sea lovely? I just love to be on a beach. It makes me feel happy. Hey, let's make a sand castle. Yes, Mr. Froggy. Let's make a sand castle together. Okay. Hey, I hit upon something hard. What do you think it is? I don't know, Harry. Why don't you dig further and see what it is? Hey, it looks like an old box. It's an old chest, Harry. Oh, can it be a treasure chest? Hey, there's something written on top of this chest. It looks like a number. Let me look at the chest, Harry. Why, it's the number 10. Hey, do you remember the number 10, Harry? Oh yes, Polly Parrot taught us that number before at the Fountain of Numbers. Do you still remember how to spell 10 then? Sure, we spell 10 like this. P, E, N, 10. Look everyone, there are some starfish here. There are 1, 2, 3, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten starfish. I can see ten starfish. Hmm, I wonder what's in this old chest. Hey, it's not locked. Let's see what's inside it. It's a crystal ball, Mr. Froggy. Hey, the crystal ball is starting to glow. There's another number in it. I think... It's the number 20! You're right, Harry! T W E N T Y 20 That's very smart of you, Barry! Who taught the both of you about the number 20? Felicia Fox taught us that, Mr. Froggy! Look, everyone! There are two groups of pills here! There are 10 pills in each group 10 pills, 20 pills. So, there are 20 pills all together. Oops. Hey, there's a piece of paper in this bottle. Ah, a message in a bottle perhaps. Try to take out the paper, Barry. Oh, I can't reach the paper, Mr. Froggy. My paw is too big. Come, let me try. Open up the paper, Harry. See what's written on it. Oh, it's another number again. It's the number 30. Correct. How do we spell 30 again, Harry? T H I R T Y 30. Ah, Felicia Fox taught the both of you about the number 30, too? Yes, Mr. Froggy. Look, here are three groups of umbrellas. 10, 20, and 30 umbrellas. There are 30 umbrellas all together. Mr. Froggy, there's another number written at the bottom of this glass bottle. You're right, Harry. That is the number 40. I know how to spell 40. F-O-R-T-Y. 40. Let's count the number of mats we have here. 10, 20, 30, and 40. We have 40 mats here. Watch out, Barry! There's something flying very fast towards you! Oh! I wonder who threw this frisbee. Thank goodness you managed to avoid it, Barry. 
If not, you'll have a terrible bump on your head. Hey, there's a number on this frisbee. It's the number 50. 50. F I V E T Y. No, Harry. It's F I F T Y. 50. 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. 50 frisbees. Thank goodness, only one frisbee flew towards me just now. Can you imagine what would happen if 50 frisbees flew towards me at the same time? I would have lots of bumps on my head then. <laughs> there! Look at the sea! Can you see the small paper boat? Mm? Oh yes! Come, let's go and have a closer look. There's a number written on this paper boat. Do you know what number this is, Harry? No, Mr. Froggy. Felicia taught us until the number 50 only. I don't know what you call this number. This is the number 60. We spell 60 this way. S-I-X-T-Y. 60. Let's count the number of spades we have here, shall we? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and 60. 60 spades. And this is how we write the number 70, Barry and Harry. 70. Mm, we spell 70 like this. S, E, V, E, N, T, Y. 70. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, and 70. 70 forks. Hey, there are some floats left here. There's a float for two people. And here's a big ring-shaped float. Wow, I think a lot of people can use these floats together. <laughs> These floats look like numbers. What numbers do you think they are? One looks like an 8, the other looks like a 0. Right. And if we put them together, what number do we get? Uh... We get the number 80. E I G H T Y. 80. Let's count the number of crabs here. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, and 80. There are 80 crabs all together. Hmm, I wonder what's making that sound. Look up to the sky. It's a jet plane. Hey, it's letting out clouds of red smoke. The jet plane is trying to write a number with its smoke. There's the number 9, and there's the number 0. Together, they form the number 90. N-I-N-E-T-Y. 90. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. 90 balls. There's a seagull flying up there. And it has something in its beak. Hey, the seagull just dropped that thing it's carrying. It looks like a piece of paper. Let's find out what is written on it. Oh, this is the number 100. O N E. H U N D R E D 100 Let's count the seashells here 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 and 100 100 seashells Little 
bird sitting on the wall. Adam and the ten. How many are there now? Thirty little black birds sitting on the wall. Adam and the ten. How many are there now? Forty little black birds sitting on the wall. Adam and the ten. Hey, let's go back to building our sandcastle, shall we? All right. Hey, what a beautiful sandcastle. Yes, it's nice, isn't it? Oh dear. I think it looks more like a pile of garbage. We certainly learned a lot from Mr. Froggy today, didn't we? Yes, Barry, and we had a good time at the beach too. <laughs> Do you remember the numbers that we have learned? Sure, Barry. I also remember the sand castle that we built. Ha <laughs> ha! We first learned the number 10. P, E, N. 10. Then we learned the number 20. T, W, E, N. T Y twenty. We also learned the number thirty. T H I R T Y thirty. After that, we learned the number forty. F O R T Y forty. We also learned the number fifty. F I F T Y 50 Next we learned the number 60 S I X T Y 60 We then learned the number 70 S E V E N T Y 70 And there was also the number 80 E I G H T Y 80 Then we had the number 90 This is how we spell 90 N I N E T Y 90 Lastly we learned the number 100 O N E H U N D R E D 100 